We are broadcasting live from Hard Slock Stadium in Miami, home of the Kraken. It's a city known for its palm trees, lovely pastel colors, and where adult diapers outsell infant diapers 10 to 1. I love adult diapers. They make going to the movies so much more fun. Why do you think they call it Miami? Old people move in retire so they can start practicing for hell. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Crooks and Skull Jugulars battle the Diami Krakens. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. And MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow and my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. Heard you got a little touch of the mutant bird and pink flu. How you feeling, partner? Well, uh, the projectile vomiting finally let up, but the, the monsoon mudslide to be done. <laughs> if you know what I mean. I've been, oh. I've been literally cramping his brains out all night. He's getting stupider by the hour, if that's even possible. And it's first and ten. Huh? Huh? And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he just left. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. Second down and six. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one time thing. First and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Second down and seven. Third down and eight. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. <laughs> and out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snags. He got hit by a car and died. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Oh, 
And it's first and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. First down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. Third down and the punter is warming up. It certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps on sides and attack. And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway, exit five. says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. Hot one, hot two, hot three. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Second down in a mile. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Third down and, well, good luck. Hot one, hot two. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Yeah. 
And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. No return on this pump. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. Not much there. Maybe a yard. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Second down and nine. really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. And it's first and ten. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. That'd be fantastic. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> One yard on that pass. Second down and nine. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. How do you like your defense is cooked? The ball carrier saying, well done. Bang, baby, bang. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. No, you didn't see that jump too fast. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And like every one of my barbecues, this guy's on fire. Does he like Crispy. Now it looks like extra crispy. I think the defenders. 
Steelers are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer. And it's first and ten. <laughs> And the defense calls a thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's got to hurt. Don't let the hair on your corpse stand straight up. Second down and ten. You've got to catch that. Third down and ten. <laughs> Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of... Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. The quarterback passes the ball, and it rebounds back. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, what a brutal hit! And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. And that'll bring up third and one. And a hard run there picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. up 10 on that run. Man, he nearly broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married... Tr Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Bricks' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. <laughs> Third and two. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. Man, guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And that's the last timeout. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling that timeout. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my 
He refuses to go down. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. And these guys are neck and neck to begin the third quarter. You talking about them two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. <laughs> they need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. And I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And it's first and ten. Hot. And he breaks away. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second and three. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. Second down in a lot. That, my friends, was an all pro NFL hit. Third down and, well, good luck. Man, what a hit that was! And it's first and ten. That run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, 
like I'm a rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. First down and nine. That's a catch for a four-yard gain. Second down and five. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They just be caught. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one time thing. First and ten. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. Man, this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about one of those video game fire modes. I mean, literally, he's like burning bacon down there. First down, and the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Second down and ten. First and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. First down and five. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. These aren't just regular aliens. They are criminal aliens. And they have a lot of moves besides dancing. And a rest that it kept the wallets. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's
It's first and ten. He is foot. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the nose, don't you think? That's sort of this whole sport. I meant the dirty trick, Bricks. The ball's going to kill the defense. But you may still have a point, actually. Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two. Eight. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Third down and long. Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Pow! With the brain scrambler. <laughs> and it's first and ten. One. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi, fermented anything really tastes good. Hot. 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 Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. It's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. warming up Discuss this on here. He's got the ball now and is going to try and. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Eight. He's not just burning down the house; he's taking it to the house. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. That's a six-yard gain on that catch. And that'll be second down and four. 
This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. And that's a pick. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Third down and, well, good luck. Two minutes left in the game. Thank God I got to take a wicked dump. Feel like I'm sitting on a wax candle. Not on my shoulder, you know. Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot. Two. That was equal parts great run and bad defense. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Boom! The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused! And then to first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult it. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus lock. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. <laughs> the kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. Usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown!
Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. That's right, folks. It's all tied up, and we are headed to overtime. I don't know how many players are left alive, but the rest are headed to sudden death. They should call this game Mutant Death League. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down! And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch! And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And with another pick, the QB. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. That's about a three yard pickup. Second down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. And that'll bring up third and one. And that'll be a first down. You know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf, huh? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, 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 hot. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down and seven. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Oh, great tackle. 
When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Second and three. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Third down and never going to happen. comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Apparently the punter for the day is being played by my kid's sister. And she they let the punt drop and it will be down by the defense. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Second down in a lot. friends was an all-pro NFL hit the offense is running low on quarterbacks they have only two left they might consider running the ball more and it's first and ten that would have been a disappointing run it's even a worse throw Second down and nine. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. What is this, 80s wrestling? Second down and long. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, 
great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. And that'll bring up third and one. Perfect pass and a score! Crockett, one at home. What feels better than that, Bricks? I did get a foot rub from a Bulgarian man once in the Navy. Very strong hands. Play stop, play stop. I'll get a moment break. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? I think the mission makes the girls dance on a pole or something. Girls win. I want a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Hey, man, nobody can touch you with an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Man? Britton Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.